by Zalamonet are the hearing the structures in that prosopitium. I don't go into the details of this, it's a bit more complicated, but eventually it's all so-called rudiment guitar type coupling, interlay exchange coupling in the same way as it is uh, in interlay exchange coupling here in that example which we found for the iron kernel structure. Okay. So you can see sometimes the time is ready for a discovery and it is discovered at, at the same time in different places. I would like to give you only a short feeling about the mechanism which is behind these coupling phenomena. And I do it in a very simple way. And, uh, well, the mechanism which leads to that uh, was uh, explored by theoretician by Patrick Lewis also sitting here. Uh, and it uh, was called the Farbiger Rome water uh, of the interlay exchange coupling, and it relies on the reflectivity of the electrons in the interlay. Again, you have the cross section here, you have the magnetic on both sides, and then uh, electrons always pass from one pair to the other across the interlayer, and you get multiple reflection in the interlayer, which is spin dependent, so it sounds rather complicated but these multiple interference effects, which depend also on the thickness of the interlayer, they give rise to this type of coupling, and since it depends on the interlayer thickness, it's reasonable that it oscillates also with the, with the function of the interlayer thickness. Now, I, I show you here again the fabric Perot, as I said before, that is called the optical fabric Perot, no, sorry, the, the fabric Perot, we are here, the fabric Perot model, 